Hey guys, it's Sammy. Welcome back to my channel. And today we are attempting a original sort of video. So I haven't seen this really anywhere. As you guys probably know, one of my favorite lines to say on this channel is, is anyone surprised? No. And that usually refers to when I say I'm going to read a book and then I don't. So in today's video, we're going to be reacting to all the books I said I was going to read in 2017 and didn't. Hopefully this won't be too long. I'm going to try to like cut it up, but I'm going to insert down here so you guys can follow along. I'm going to screen record my laptop for you guys. But yeah, we're going to be going through my videos and going through all the books I said I was going to read in 2017 and didn't. We're going to pull up my YouTube channel, my December wrap up and TBR jar. Okay, so basically I'm being annoying, but basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick a book and then I'm going to try to read it. Um, and that book was Shadow and Bone by Leigh Bardugo. Did I read that? No. <laughs> so that's the first book I'm going to have on this little list here. So that's the first book that I said I was going to read and didn't. So next is um, Winter Biennial Bibliothon 2017 TBR. The first one... Maniscalco. This is the group book. I do hope to read it, although... You're not gonna read it. You didn't even own it. Like, you didn't even own it. Like, what are you talking about? So, Stalking Jack the Ripper. Did not own it. Don't know why I thought I was going to read it. Um, next is City of Fallen Angels. So, I don't- I- I read this last year. So, I did read City of Fallen Angels, so that's a check. Three Dark Crowns. I did not finish Three Dark Crowns until this year, but I'm just going to count it because eventually I did read it. I did read- the Wrath and the Dawn. 1001 Night, so that was good. I have also read the, the, and the, um, the Rose and the Dagger. Also good. Yeah, so we only had one book and the one book I didn't actually own. So honestly, even though I'm pretty sure I read none of those books during that time period, um, it really sucks. Either way, super excited. Hopefully I can get to most of these books. You didn't get to, I'm pretty sure you didn't get to any of them, but we're just going to let that slide. Books I need to read in 2017. I remember this video. I said I was going to read Lady Midnight. Because I said that, that meant I also need to read City of Lost Souls, City of Heavenly Fire, The Bane Chronicles, Tales of the Shadow Hunter Academy, The Shadow Hunter's Codex, and then Lady Midnight. So that is six books. That did not happen. Absolutely positively did not happen. And then I said Crooked Kingdom. You know what I meant by that? I meant all the Shadow and Bone trilogy and then Six of Curse duology. That's another five books. Did I read any of those? No, I did not read a single one. What, what was I thinking? Like literally, what was I? No, 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 no. Oh, The Raven King. Have I started that? No, that's another four. No, I have not started that series. Like what, what was I thinking? No, what was I thinking? I don't know what it is. I don't know what these books are about. I yeah, know. I still don't really know what they're about, honestly. And then I was like, oh, well, I can definitely read The Sun is Also a Star. No, I didn't read that. Throne of Glass? Nope, didn't read that one. And by Throne of Glass, I also meant the prequel, um, The Assassin's Blade, so that's two. Did not read them. Did I read any of them on here? I'm starting to get a little concerned. The Rose and the Dagger. Did read that, but we've already talked about that. The Unexpected Everything. Was it just- I was so excited for it because I love contemporary books, or at least I did in the past. Now they're- weaning off of me a little bit but regardless I was so excited for this book I went out on the release date I went out and bought it and I still haven't read it and I still haven't read it to this day I still haven't read uh, the only Morgan Matson book that I have read is Amy and Roger's Epic Detour and honestly I didn't even like it that much um I heard they get better but no I haven't read The Unexpected Everything I'm sorry like this is just embarrassing at this point The Winner's Curse Nope. Have read Three Dark Crowns, but once again, I've already mentioned that. Oh, Harry Potter. I said I was going to read the entirety of Harry Potter last year too. That's funny. I just started Harry Potter in like March, so I'm going to say the seven Harry Potters. It's just the Harry Potter series. I'm like, is it like that good? Like, is it really that good? I, I don't know. It is. And then that's really the end of it. I'm sure in the end, I'm talking about how I won't read all these. Potter series, which I count as one, but if I were to read the whole Harry Potter series and read all the books I mentioned, including like the books I would need to read to read them, it's 31 books. Last year I read 40 books total and I read what? Like three of those? No, two. I'm so, uh, I'm so, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. It's fine. Moving on. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. 
Yep, yep, yep. Okay, okay guys. I'm not counting these again. I read City of Fallen Angels, but the rest of them I have not. I've read both The Wrath of the Dawn and The Rose and the Dagger. Great books. I love them. Shadow and Bone, mentioned it before. Did, did not read. Have not read. Are any of these books gonna be new books? I feel like, no, they're not. <laughs> they're just books I, <laughs> they're just books that I've wanted to read in previous, but um, didn't read. So yeah, that is my very tentative TBR for the rest of January, February, and the beginning of March. Obviously, I plan to meet, read more books, especially if I want to meet my goal by the end of the year, and also just because like that's not that many books that I was planning to read. I'm trying to read like around four or five books a month. Uh-uh. I read maybe like one or two books a month. And obviously that wasn't like the equivalent, but I'm really excited regardless. I think that this year is going to be a really great reading year no, for me and I can't it wasn't. explain enough how excited I am to get into all these series it so that wasn't. raves about. I will shut up now because you literally heard me say this like 10 million times. But thank you guys so much for watching. I so bad. Anyway, moving on. Spring TBR. You're about to see all the same books again because I didn't read them in, in, in the winter. Okay. I've got a lot of books to show you. And Ooh, what the hell is this lipstick? The last two books. I'm currently reading this, as you can see. <laughs> it's happening right now. I, I did not finish that. I probably still have a bookmark in that book. I did not finish it. I, I literally cannot finish it. It's so not great. Allegedly. Here's another book that I said I was going to read. Did not read. Did not read. Did not. Alright guys, so I just put 10 books on my TBR for the spring. Hopefully, I can get to some of them, and of course- I didn't get to any- like, what was I reading? Like, on it- okay. Honestly, like, I'm starting to get a little confused. Was I really not reading anything? I guess, like- I know I only read- did I only read 30 books last year? Or was it 40? You know what? Was it 30? Oh my god, it was 25. Oh, oh my god. I read tw I only I read 27 books last year. Holy shit. Yeah, no wonder I didn't get to any of these. Oh my god, and three of these two of these were rereads. This I reread and in anticipation for this. These three These three are novellas. They were probably like 20 pages each. Oh my god. And then this like this is what I read in the entirety before going to school. This is a Wattpad novel, which is bad. And then these, this I listened to, oh, I did finish this. I finished One Dark Throne in January. So I did finish this. The rest of these, this is an audiobook, this is an audiobook, 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 audiobook. This doesn't even count. Audiobook, audiobook. Other books I'm gonna throw in. Mood reads, I am definitely a mood reader, but these Sam, you didn't read any of these books. What are you talking about? You're a mood reader. You just didn't read it all. <laughs> this is just unfortunate. Summer TBR. I don't know why we're doing this at this point. Because they're just gonna hey be- Hey guys, it's Sammy. Welcome hey. back to my I'm such a fake. Oh Wait, my god. Oh my god. I've t You guys have been so sick of me. Why did I even make these videos? Oh my god. It's the same books. It's the same books. It's the same books. Oh, Kissing Max Holden. I read that. I had an arc of that. I read it. Oh my god. Obviously, I want to read more books. Um, you'll I, see I always say that. I didn't read them. My biannual bibliothon slash booktubeathon TBR that there's more books that I want to read over my vacation. And I read one book on my vacation. One. One, but we're gonna talk about them real quick. I'm pretty sure I brought like a Sarah Dessen book, and I, ne I like and I. The so I love that necklace. Mm. The Raven Boys. Will I read that. all of these books? I'm honest in my descriptions. Will I read all these books? Probably not. But I have faith that I will read a lot of them. You honestly didn't. You're just lying. I brought the first Harry Potter book. Didn't read it. I brought that. I did read. The sun. I'll give you the sun. Nope. Highly illogical behavior. I have read now, but at the time, had not read, so didn't read that summer. I did end up reading 
they dark crowns that year but not during that time period no we're just gonna do my fall tbr oh my gosh the i'm becoming a more dire my birthday oh my god my birthday's coming up too so many new books I didn't read the I'm becoming a murderer. I don't really know what's about The Handmaid's Tale by Margaret. I finished this on like the first day of 2018. So I'm going to count that. I'm not going to write it down. Anna Dressen Blood, I did read. I think that's basically because I said that because I already had started it though and I listened to it on audiobook. So The Raven Boys, no. Did not read The Raven Boys, no. That does not happen. Winter Break was a hellhole. So no, I did not do that. And that's really it. So yeah, that's basically going to be it that I'm going to commit myself to. I also have a few other books here that I talked about in my books I brought to college. Books I brought to college, one of these corners, I can never get it right. And I obviously have those here too, so if I'm not really feeling one of these books, I'll probably pick up one. You're not, you're not feeling any of these, but you did not read. You just listened to audiobooks. Because that's the only thing I could do in college. Like I literally could not read. This is horrible. In my January wrap up, I did a TBR jar. I did those for like the first, I don't know, not- Hey guys, it's Sammy, welcome back to my channel. Oh my channel. god, I'm so and loud. Today, here, so, we're gonna pick one. Oh my god. It was... Okay, alright, here is that book, I actually- My March wrap up. What was the book here? Oh my god, this is so funny. That Summer by Sarah Desson. That's funny because I didn't read that, but I said I was going to do it later in the year and I still didn't do it. I'm literally such a fake. What happened in April? I didn't read anything. Did I do a TBR jar? That's one of my favorite books I've I ever did. read. It was just so it the Akatar series. Jar here. Cinder by Marie <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. That's hilarious. No, I didn't read Cinder. Are you kidding me? No. And June, I think, is probably the last month I did that because after that, I don't think I did a wrap. Yeah, no. I didn't do another wrap up until summer, my summer wrap up. And I was at school at that point. I didn't have my T bar dry. That's funny. Hey guys, it's Sammy. Welcome what back. is this coloring, girl? Home girl, what is this? Ew. Why is this only 3 minutes and 49 seconds? Read it. Five Summers, Five Summers by, by Una Marsh. I honestly don't even know why oh, I still have that book. I, I probably should get rid of it. Honestly though, my makeup kind of looks good. This video was way too long. Um, okay, so uh, that's going to be it. I'm so sorry I subjected you to that. I understand if you clicked out. So over here you will see the books I actually read in, in 2017. And the books I said I was going to read. Stalking Jack the Ripper, not over there. Six of the Cassandra Clare books which would be City of Lost Souls, City of Heavenly Fire, The Bane Chronicles, Tales of the Shadowhunter Academy, wait, yeah, Tales of the Shadowhunter Academy, Shadowhunter Codex, and Lady Midnight, as you can see, not over there, five, the five Lee Bardugo books, which are the Shadow and Bone Trilogy and Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom, did not read all four of the Raven Boys Quartet, did not read those, um, The Sun is Also a Star, did not read that, um, the first two books in the Throne of Glass series, did not read that. Um, The Unexpected Everything. Five Summers by Una LaMarche. The Seven Harry Potter books. Allegedly, um, I'll Give You the Sun. Among others. We're not gonna even read them all. It comes to a total of 37 books. That I did, that I said I was going to read, and did not read. So, if that doesn't explain how bad I am, I don't know what will. So, if you made it through this entire video, I thank you, because this was, um, pretty bad but once again I say thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this original video um comment down below a book you said you were gonna read in 2017 and didn't I look forward to seeing all the books that you guys talk about um yeah thank you guys so much for watching I hope you have a great day bye we are